every day. Today could be the day. And what we're reading about right there in Acts chapter 2 is we're in this collection of the church. church. This is the birth of the church. This is the day of Pentecost. And on the day of Pentecost, this is when the Holy Spirit fell. And with it, all of a sudden, the church, which we're doing today, is birthed in a moment. I, I love this picture because uh, Pentecost, it comes from the Greek word Pentecost, which means 50. So it's 50 days after Jesus has resurrected, and there's 120 believers in an upper room, and the Holy Spirit falls. But notice what the passage says. The passage says that suddenly the sound of a violent wind began to blow. I like that, that suddenly, that the day that changed every day for all of us, the day of Pentecost, that day came sudden. Someone say sudden. Sudden. Oh, I feel it in my heart today. Suddenly, suddenly by definition, means quickly, or without warning, or unexpected. Quickly, without warning, or unexpected. I was doing a wedding on Friday night for an amazing couple in our church, and it was beautiful, and I was at the reception afterwards, and a gentleman on our host team, his name is Alex, he came up to me and said, Pastor Rich, and he was holding a girl's hand. He said, can I just give you a quick testimony? I know it's somebody else's wedding, but I just want to share what God has done in our life. He said, about a year and a half ago, I went through one of the greatest heartbreaks of my life. And he said, this girl that you see next to me, we had been friends that moved for over six years. And during that heartbreak, her and I began to get closer and closer. And all of a sudden, I sensed me fall in love with her. And he said, but the problem was, is that while it was happening, I didn't believe that God could do something so quickly. He said, last month, I know it's somebody else's wedding, but last month we got married. 